I'm going to show how to create trigger link in drip and what's involved uh, so first in order to use trigger link you have to create a trigger link first in rules and so go in automation rules okay new basic rule and you can change the rule name right now I'm just gonna leave it as rule 19 and then choose trigger and trigger is clicked a trigger link and then you gotta enter a URL that's required and you can put in any URL like thank you page wherever you want your subscriber to go to or see a web page after they click the trigger link so I'm just gonna use my website address here and then we want an action so maybe we want to apply a tag so you say apply a tag and you can put uh, clicked registration link or whatever you want in there as your tag and then you can actually add multiple action here so next one is if you want to send a campaign when they click on this link so not only apply a tag but send a campaign or a workflow you can choose I'm just gonna choose Black Friday promo or whatever and it just gives me a warning that this campaign is not active so you make sure that the campaign is active or workflow whatever you have chosen save rule rule saved and then I'm gonna go to let's say go to broadcast so just have an email I've already created a test email here so you create an email as part of your campaign or broadcast or whatever you're using and then let's just jump to email and over here I have this already let's just go directly to so once you select the text that you want a link assigned to it so click on trigger link and then so which rule we just created rule number 19 and then which trigger URL you could create a new one if you want it over here um, or select um, the one that you specified for the rule for this trigger link that you just created and insert and the email I think is saved already and that's it that's all you need